Hey, what's up, everybody? I wanted you guys to check this out. Um, doing a little live session here. Uh, I guess nobody's obviously here yet, but um, yeah. So this is the machine I'm testing today. So I guess I'll wait for a couple of people to come in before I start jamming out. Check that shit out. That is literally an app called Inkweasel that works with these machines. This machine is called the Silkworm. I'll tell you more about it soon. <laughs> Excuse me for sneezing. See what anybody is saying or anything. So, yeah, I guess I'll uh, set this up in a row. Let's see.
So, guys, uh, I don't know how well you can see, but, uh, yeah, this machine runs on an audio interface. So, pretty much to, to turn it on, you have to use a foot pedal, and it is connected to this type of uh, power supply. And this is actually not a power supply. This is an amplifier. So I'll be doing a full review on this machine. I also have this machine here. This is a cartridge dedicated machine. It's an inner coil audio interface machine. So I just, I'm waiting to get a uh, attachment so I could use my uh, Cheyenne grips with it. So I, but uh, this machine here, the Silkworm, it runs cartridges and it runs standard needles as well. So yeah, I mean, it pretty much sounds like a coil, but watch this. I have different presets that I can work with here. So you guys can see what I'm doing. Oops, there goes my Apple Pencil. <laughs> okay. Trying my best. Pick that up. And all of these presets can be saved and adjusted however you want. You can give it more power, less power. And you could automatically save it by holding down on one of these, just like that, and it'll save to whatever. So we'll start with, uh, with the hammerhead. The, uh, the first one is a hammerhead. That's what uh, the owner calls it. So, let's see how that plays out. And I am using a loose 14 here. synthetic skin this thing runs great I can tell you right now I got to get one thing need a rinse cup the small one I'm sorry guys that I've haven't you know posted this seminar yet you know I've been dealing with issues of life stuff like that so it's it's been uh oh sorry about that as well <laughs> okay trying to get this right over here
Yeah, so definitely can't have that channel on there. Sorry about that, guys. I had to blow my nose because apparently I sniffle too much when I record these videos. I guess that's what happens when you have allergies uh, continuously for your entire life, you know? And then you got assholes that come on your channel and pretty much tell you that they almost threw up. From watching your video because you sniffle so much. Yeah. Honestly, y'all, I don't think my channel is going to be lasting a hell of a lot longer. I'm going to finish up doing a couple of the reviews that I have left to do. And I think I'm just going to call it a day because, you know, I'm not really going to keep buying machines to review. And I don't really want to review any machines from China anymore because all of these Chinese companies, like I said in one of my previous videos, they, they don't do anything but lie to you. They could care less about uh, your reputation. They can care less if uh, you're a good artist, a bad artist. All they care about is selling you equipment, and that's all. Also, like this whole, I feel like this whole YouTube thing is a waste of time. You know, it just. With everything else that I have going on in my life, you know, I don't, I don't really make any money doing this. From all the videos that I've done, I've probably made $30. You know? <laughs> You know, I don't really care about the money, you know. I I thought that maybe, you know, I'd start making something and I'd be able to, you know, buy machines to review for you guys and then give them away. But it doesn't look like that's going to happen. 
unfortunately. So if you guys don't see any videos from me anymore, well, what can I say? You know, I tried. So, like I was saying, these machines, the machine I'm working with right now is an AC machine. It's made by Electric Shark Tattoo, a guy by the name of Richard Dettore. I don't know if I'm pronouncing the name correct, Richard, the last name. 
It's D E T O R E. So I hope that I did not ruin that your last name for you, bro. <laughs> but however you pronounce it, this guy is a freaking genius. It's pretty amazing what this silkworm machine is doing so far. And uh, I showed in the beginning of the video the interface that it works with. I will show it to you guys again. 